There is nothing quite like match day inside a football stadium, especially when there's so much on the line. The build-up has been intense, and now we just can't wait for us all to begin. It's anyone's guess, though, which team will come out on top in front of a packed house. The action is live. Good evening, everyone. A city that has so much to offer in so many respects, but of course on the football front as well. Hello from the English capital, London. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. I'm looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Tottenham Hotspur facing Burnley. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. This is the starting lineup for Tottenham Hotspur. Dejan Kulusevski plays with Hyung Min Son out wide, and the striker is Richarlison. Misfiring completely. Yeah, he's gone for power, but the contact was never right. It's a poor effort, really. Well, we're focusing on a player who just seems to get better and better, Hyung Min Son. What do you expect to see from him today, Stuart? Well, three goals in the last three games. He's in great form at the moment. He's playing with confidence as well. Every chance he could add to that tally today. And a look at the starting lineup for Burnley. Well, the wingers will be key here. They have to choose the right time to give width and the right time to come infield to support the centre. Oh, hang on, Stuart. Big chance here. Well, it goes down as a miss so early in this game. Well, it may be early in the game, but that should have been a goal. No doubt about that. That's a big chance. Fine work from Burnley to win back possession. Berge. Good one, Son. Vigorous defending. And a throw in for Burnley. And players waiting in the centre. Can they forge ahead? Well, the keeper is happy. The bar was there. Threat over for now, it seems. Spurs have lost the ball. Teammates available. Oh, in with a chance. And getting across to stop it. Well, you sense it's just a matter of time before they do score, Derek. They've been piling on the pressure now and really should be ahead in this one. Now the counter-attack looks on. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? Well, it was apparently a bookable offence. Well, no debate over that one. It's a yellow card all day long. James Madison... opportunity and saved by the keeper and well, they're going for the short one just the challenge that was required and Spurs moving the ball with purpose Opportunity it is, and he's missed the opportunity to net the opening goal. Well, it should be 1-0, Derek. You can see how frustrated he is with himself. Yeah. Will he shoot? The fans hope so. Can he finish? And still danger here. And problem solved for now. Well, they must exercise caution standing off as they are. A chance to whip it in. 
Well, it could be on for him here. And the keeper there to deal with it. Well, the short corner routine. Cutting infield here. Foiling his opponent completely. Maybe a chance for Spurs here to take the lead from a corner. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. Oh, he's blocked it! Good one, Son. Is this the moment? And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Saar. And in the right position to read it. Could be troublesome. Really good build up, but no end product. Richarlison. And on to Kurusevsky. Well, Spurs have dominated the flow of the game in the last 15 minutes or so and have looked great oh, going. Oh, look at this, they must score! Spectacular save, top-class goalkeeping. Now the pass not finding its target. Roberts. Goodmanson. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. So back underway and a wake-up call for Tottenham, perhaps. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. And given away. Richarlison. It's still there for him. No more time left. That is it for the first half here at the home of Tottenham. And away they go again. Work to do for Spurs in this second half. Berge. Possession one. Possession seeded by Spurs. Cullen. Now options are plenty. A oh, chance perhaps. And a decent save, full credit. And they will make the change now. They favoured a short one here. Very quick thinking there. on well they might be able to launch a counter attack well, that was a good counter attack in the making but very alert defending Roberts O'Shea Berge well, what can they do to stop him running at them well, it wasn't a taxing save. Pat Matar-Sar. Son. Goodman, sir. You've had a mobile phone handed in. If you've lost your mobile phone, can you please make your way to reception? Well, it's a decent-looking attack, Miss. 
He got a good palm on it. Well, what a great save that was to keep them in this. May just be the impetus they need, as they certainly have... You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. And that is going to mean a caution. The referee is absolutely right. He knew what he was doing there. Richarlison. Oh, this is looking promising. Richarlison! And it nestles in the back of the net. A goal for Tottenham Hotspur, who now are on level terms. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. De Chimier. And now with Delcroix. Number nine. Mike Trezor and Dei Chimier. A chance to whip it in. And the shot. Well, credit to him for trying it. Didn't miss by much. So making the substitution now. Well, as you can see, this has been a fairly open contest. Chances at both ends. Plenty of good attack in play. And it's been really entertaining. A Spurs free kick it's going to be. Lo Celso. And he's through here. A goal here! Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Cullen. Josh Brownhill. Well, moving the ball forward, they might be in business. Delivering it into the box. And the move breaks down. Fabier. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Very effective pass. Can he finish? Can he finish them off? He's done it. What a climax to this game. Well, just watch this again. A change of pace, a change of direction, and a decent finish. That's a very good goal. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Jay Rodriguez and through for the goal kick he hit it with power Bisuma and Hoybier with it and it wasn't a great pass was it Rodriguez and goes for goal well, the goalkeeper's life wasn't made quite as difficult as might have been the case. Hoybier. 
Giovanni Lo Celso. Pat Matar Saar. Well, three minutes of stoppage time added on here. The fans are shouting, shoot! Well, nothing comes of it. It might be! Oh, it was a crucial challenge! Oh, that's a super piece of defending. And with that, the referee says that is the end of the match. And Spurs victorious. The fans are going to be happy with this. Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.